Oh, there she is, guys. We were looking for you. You're two minutes late. No, I came here on time. It's just I've been sitting here the entire time, and I'm just in a mood. What's wrong? I got beat by my dad last night. Parker saved me, but I'm worried about Wendy. She deserves so much better, but there's nothing I can do about it. There's always calling the cops. We all want to, but we refuse to be separated from each other. I hate seeing her hurt. I'll see you soon. Okay. All right. Oh. Hey. Hi. Um, can we talk? Sure. But like, in private? Okay. What's up? Um, I have this friend who's upset because her mom got hurt. And she has a sister who's feeling guilty because she's hiding a huge secret about the family. And the sister wants to make her sister feel better. What does she do? Well, if your friend's sister feels guilty, she should just talk about it. Yeah, but I... I mean... Her sister doesn't want to reveal it yet, but still wants to help. Well then, she needs to be there for her sister. Sisters are for life whether you like it or not. Mm. Okay. Thanks, Josh. I can't wait to tell her that you're a lifesaver. <laughs> no problem. Um, <laughs> also, I was wondering if we can hang out, just you and me. Are you asking if we can go on a date? Yeah, kinda. <laughs> I mean, you don't have to if you don't want to. I totally understand. If you don't, I... Opal? Yeah? <laughs> I'd love to. How about dinner at a restaurant? Tonight, I'll pick you up at 7. That would be amazing. <laughs> okay. Alright. I gotta get to class. I'll see you later. Bye. Yes! <laughs> Nina, I thought we all agreed that we're gonna have carrots for lunch. Um, what? It's my cheat day. Ugh. Anyway, so back to the story I was telling. So, she then says that, um, you're ugly, and I'm like, well, you're stupid. Can you believe her? No way. Opal? Opal, are you listening? What? Oh, sorry, yeah, she's stupid. Um, I gotta go talk to my sister. Why? Ugh, forget it. What do you want? We need to talk now. Okay. Come on. Uh, be right back, guys. Now, what do you want? 
I saw you crying about what happened to Wendy. She is okay, is she? Why would you even care, Opal? You don't even live with us anymore. Kylie, you never cared, Opal. You've been living in your little fantasy world of popularity while I'm trying to stay the same one in the family. I get good grades. I have a boyfriend now. I have a little sister to take care of. Wendy's a whole mess and my friends I have to worry about. I go through a whole lot and you're just in your own world. Try having to say something to that, huh, Opal? Try being kicked out by our dad. Try always arguing with a person who takes care of me and then running away to find a place to live. Try always being worried about the family I was kicked out of. Kylie, I do care about you. I know I can be annoying and rude, but I still care about you. You are my twin. George was so cruel to separate us. I'm sorry I yelled. I'm sorry I wasn't there for you when you needed someone. You're an idiot, but I love you. And you're a nerd, but I love you too. If you need someone to talk to, come to me. And don't worry about my friends. I'll be there for you. Thanks, Opal. The same goes for you. <laughs> okay, let's go back to lunch, because this conversation is only between you and me. No one else knows about this. Agreed. Let's get out of here. Second. Okay, Opal, you look good. Your makeup's great. Your outfit's great. Okay. <sighs> All right, let's do this. Come in. Hello, Josh. Good evening, Opal. <laughs> you look amazing. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> this whole thing. <laughs> shall we? We shall. <laughs> let's go. 